Since 1949, Hayes Conference Centre in Derbyshire has played host to one of the UK's most rewarding and welcoming events for writers, the Swanwick Writers Summer School. In August each year, 300 novelists, short story writers, poets, journalists and writers of all kinds gather to improve their craft, sharing their experiences, learning from expert tutors and speakers, and fostering relationships that endure long after the week is over. For many, the Writers' Summer School is not a one-off event, but something they return to year after year. The centre's idyllic surroundings and the warm atmosphere among the delegates make for an unmatched opportunity both to unwind and relax in like-minded company and to get on with some serious writing. Um, so is this your first Sonic? No, we've been, this is our fourth, fourth in a row. Yes. You come back every year? We, we do, yeah. We, we, the first time we came, we, uh, we, we sort of caught the atmosphere of it and we've been back ever since. We met Joyce. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> we Joyce met was Joyce. the first person we met. <laughs> and, and, and you still came back despite me too. <laughs> <laughs> how, how many years have you been coming to Swanwick? This is my seventh year. Seven years on the trial? Yes, I was one of the first top right people who came in 2005. And why do you keep coming back? It's just so wonderful. It's They say that's the Swanwick magic and it's definitely true. It's just so lovely atmosphere, great teaching, so much fun meeting new people and meeting your old friends and it's just really, really brilliant. What courses are you here for particularly? Um, I've been doing quite a bit of non-fiction in the past, but this year I decided to do something that I've never done before. So I've done sci-fi and fantasy and crime writing and these kind of things. So it's wonderful to learn new things that you don't know that much about. Rebecca Woodhead, um, writing magazine contributor and surprise star of Swanwick this year. Um, this is your first year at Swanwick? It is indeed, yes. And what are you here to talk about? Well, I came here to talk about e-publishing um, and my take on e-publishing, which is not so techy and more to do with kind of brain technology. But and it was great fun. Did, did you enjoy it? I loved it. I loved it. Fabulous audience, um, amazing speakers as well. And there's just a great atmosphere here as well, so it was great fun. How many years have you been coming to Swanwick? My first year was 1983, Gosh. when I had to get two very small children babysat. Now they're middle-aged women with their own homes. <laughs> <laughs> so you come every year since then? Almost every year. I came every year for the first 20 years and then decided I might take a little break. Mm -hmm. So since then I've been coming most years, but not every year. And you, the courses you're leading this year? A poetry course. Mm. It's a four session course. People are coming along studying all different aspects of the craft and there's going to be a great reading at the end of it of all the work they've produced during this week. Would, what would make you recommend Swanwick to anybody else? It's the atmosphere. There is definitely um, a very welcoming, very friendly, yeah. very egalitarian type of feel about it that's, that's very embracing actually and very inspirational. Yeah.